Hello and welcome to Steelers Production 36. Today, we will be talking to you about the beginning of preseason. As we all know, today is our first preseason game against the Detroit Lions. It's very exciting, basically because it's been such a long offseason. It feels like it took forever for, the, for this preseason to come around. What I'm looking forward to in watching to t in this game is probably the quarterback race. Because as we all know, Ben Roethlisberger is suspended for the first four to six weeks of the beginning of the season, the regular season. So I, I want to find out who is the new starting quarterback. My guess right now, who's leading the whole chase, would probably be Byron Lef Lefwich, then Dennis Dixon and Charlie Batch. If worse comes to worse, we all know Antoine Randall L has played quarterback in high school. And from his Super Bowl performance in Super Bowl 40, I think we can kind of tell that he can pass the ball a tiny bit. Otherwise, this game will be pretty exciting. I am looking forward to seeing how our halfbacks, Jonathan Dwyer and Isaac Redstone and Redmond, will be playing today. I'm also excited to see how our receivers will do today, specifically because we lost Santonio Holmes. I want to know how. Randall L is going to do, I want to know how Emmanuel Sanders is going to do, it, it, it's very exciting. And also I want to see how our safeties do, that's something pretty big to me, especially because Troy Palaman, Palamalu got injured last season, but hopefully he, he'll stay healthy this year. If not, la we don't even have Tyrone Carter anymore, who wasn't such a big factor last season, but uh, as we all know, we need someone to back up Troy. Because we don't have a super load of depth on defense. I'm also looking forward to a tiny bit of seeing how Jeff Reed and Daniel Spadulova will do. Basically because kicking last year wasn't that great, especially in the first three weeks of the season. We missed a lot of field goals and had a lot of short punts. I want to see how our special teams do, This, is, which will be very exciting. On a quick note, let's just do around the league. first talk to you about the Cincinnati Bengals. I believe they'll be the worst team in the AFC North this year. Specifically because they have way too many egos for, for my liking this time. They have Chad Ochocinco, Terrell Owens, and Adam Pacman Jones. All three of them, that's a bad combination. I could see by week five, Carson Palmer will just have such a bad time with all his receivers asking for the ball, or well, except Adam Pacman Jones because he plays corner. But still, with Terrell Owens and Chad Ochocinco, and I can see a tiny bit of ego in Cedric Benson because of like his, him going to jail right now. Like I think this is really bad for the Bengals right now. I don't think that they will play that good because they'll be demanding to get the ball too often. That will be a huge problem. And finally, I would just like to say that the Steelers will have a terrific game against the Lions today. I believe that we will see a great combination of both skill and a great game to watch. It's going to be exciting. I can't wait to see which rookie will stand out this season. So, with that said, I would like to say, see you next time on Steelers Production 36.